Jarrett from Source Audio here, and I will demonstrate how to save searches. First, actually perform a search, whether that be with keywords, filters, using Sonic Search, or a combination of all three. I used keywords and I used filters to do this search. Now I want to come back to this later, so what I can do is save this search. So in the top right, I'll click Save This Search. I'll name this, so I'll name it for now Jarrett Search. You might want to be a little more specific than this because if you're coming back to it at a later date, this will be a little too generic, but this is fine for now. Then click Save at the bottom left. It automatically saves to your dashboard. So go into your dashboard, click Save Searches in the left tab, and you'll see the search that you just saved. If you click the red X, this will actually delete the search you just did, or you can go right back into the search by clicking the name. And here you go. I'm back in the search. I can get back to this at any time. I could log out of my account. I could log back in. And if I go to my dashboard in that area, I can always go back and go to this search. Now, Sonic Search will look a little bit different. Here's an example of that. And you'll see, though, that the Save This Search button is still in the top right. So it's the same process. Click this, name it, save it to your dashboard, access it at any time.